Well, hello everyone. So, um, I'm actually driving in and out of rainstorms and the lightning's a little crazy. Um, I finished up the door job, so pretty much all the doors that I had to build are done. Um, I did end up selling a, where I'm building doors, but I don't have to install them. And I'm going to be working on that this weekend. Uh, but all in all, uh, very happy about getting done. And right when I was pulling out of the road, or out of his driveway, it started raining. So I was like, Phew. But I got there at uh, about 7.40 in the morning and finished right at about 12 o'clock. Well, it's like 12.30 after cleaning up and everything. So I'm off to go get some wheel bearings for chaos. And at 5.30 tonight, ooh, 5.30 tonight, I'm uh, going to go over to the shop and hopefully get them done. Uh, a friend of mine has a lift and, you know, we're going to see what happens. Um, do kind of want to talk about what happened last night. So, Trump won that debate because uh, Biden lost the debate. You know, he lost... He, Damn, he lost a lot more than just the debate, but um, it really makes you think who's really running the country because that dude's out of it. You know, and, and just you have to understand that it's been what I think it was seven days or ten days or however many days it was that he was preparing, and just I feel sorry for the guy, you know. And um, I will say I'm a little, I'm not going to say disappointed. Uh, no, I'm disappointed in Trump. Because there were some questions that he could have done real easy answers to. And he was too busy playing catch up. And, you know, Biden said this and it's not true. And, you know, of course, Biden was saying Trump said this and it's not true. So it really depends on what news media you were, you know, you watch. On to whether someone's lying or telling the truth. You know, and uh, right after the debate, uh, you know, I was watching the debate on CNN, and CNN instantly went to, we got to get rid of Biden. You know, this is horrible. We got to get rid of him, which I kind of had a feeling they were going to say that anyways. Uh, I wasn't expecting them to say it two minutes after the debate, you know, uh, but y'all see this lightning? Jesus. So, um, but I have mixed emotions about that. One, you know, if he stays in and he and he's voted back in, I will agree with Trump that it's America's over. Period. You know, it's basically you get what you can get, and you're running your eyes and you try to live a good life somewhere. Um, I don't think Trump's going to be a dictator. I don't think Trump's going to be. Uh, you know, the king, you know, I think he's going to do a lot of stuff to try to help this country. Whether it does or doesn't, don't know. But I think uh, we have a better shot of surviving via Trump, uh, or with Trump, and a Trump via Biden race. If they replace him, I kind of, I mean, in one aspect, I'm scared to see him in a Biden being put back in office. Uh, in another aspect, uh, them trying to get another, uh, you know, to go through a primary process to vote in a, uh, a Democrat running mate that's uh, going to replace Biden, I think that's going to be a shit show and a half. You know, because they're going to be vying for it. They're going to be beating each other up just like when Kamala was telling, you know, Biden that, you know, Biden's policies back in the day, which now he don't agree with, but, you know, was putting him or putting her, you know, in the back of the bus and all that kind of mess. So it's going to be that all over again. I hope I survive this. Jesus, guys, this lightning is crazy right now. Uh, I was actually trying to listen to the radio and it was messing up the radio so I just said hell I'm gonna make a video so I don't know if y'all see it this lightning or at least the flashing but my god 
So the rain's not too bad, but that lightning is insane. But anyway, so I've, I mean, you know, as long as Trump is running, I'm voting for Trump. That's where I'm at. You don't have to like me for it, you know, but for everything that I've learned so far and everything that I know in my life, um, Trump is going to do a better job being president than Biden, period, and down. That's my opinion. If you don't agree, then I would love to sit down and have coffee or lunch with you and let's, let's call, you know, um, but yeah, it's, it's, it is what it is, you know, it's, but Biden has shown his colors that he is no longer, you know, uh, the acting president of the United States because if he is, that kind of explains why everything's, you know, gone so wrong. You know what? <laughs> if I'm wrong about what I'm saying, now is a perfect opportunity for God to say no, you know? <laughs> Oh my, this is insane. I'm not, I'm gonna wait to get out of the truck. I'm not gonna try getting out of the truck in the train. But, but no, it's like 2.30. Uh, I really can't go to the shop till 5.30. So I was thinking about going somewhere and just kind of hanging out, maybe going to, uh, I think it's Culver's and getting a hamburger there. Yeah. But man, oh man. Uh oh. The lights are off at the place. Can I come in? All right, anyways, the uh, power's out, so uh, anyways, I'll, uh, peace, love, money, I'll talk with you later.